we would even have this opportunity. But my dad did have a suggestion on his character. <laughs> Actually, you already laugh because you know how my dad is already. So the first thing he says is like, all right, if it happens, let's say the movie happens. But if it does, I want Ray Winston to play me. And I was like, oh, all, right, all right, Dad, I don't know if that will happen, but we'll see. So then he got told that Nick Frost was in. So if you know my dad, which you kind of figure him out, he, does, he, does, he knows nothing about modern day movies or anything like that. He loves Zulu, he loves Laurel and Hardy and stuff. And so he was like, who the hell is Nick Frost? <laughs> and I was Nick like, Frost. Dad, he's really talented. He did Shaun of the Dead, Hot Fuzz. Like, we're, we're, me and my brother were massive fans. So we're like, this is incredible. And then he was like, we'll see how he does. But, <laughs> so then he watches the movie, and then he's like, yeah, he's actually pretty good, isn't he? Yeah. And then he's like, okay, I'll compliment him. Vincent, how, does, how did playing Hutch, uh, how, did he, how did that play to your strengths? Because, you know, he's got a lot of energy, but he also has a big heart, and he's, uh, you know, this uh, a character, uh, you know, your performance, you seem like you were able to sort of, like, uh, go off the cuff and, and improvise a little bit, which is something that, you know, like for years and years, you've always been super great at, too. Well, you know, when I, when I came into the, uh, I turned it off here. <laughs> uh, when I came into the situation, the script was still being formed, and I think some of the tricks were, how do you make something where it's kind of a, the event like how page one, the WWE, it's not as if it's a sports team in a traditional game that's being played out. So I just participated with Stephen quite a bit on trying to locate how do we set things up to pay off that people would understand and you know really collaborate with him a lot with dialogue and that kind of stuff, just in sort of, uh, I guess, leaving blood, uh, 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 breadcrumbs that everyone could kind of follow. So it was a lot of camaraderie. The other girls were very nice and really a nice group of yeah. actors. and. Um, you know, we just all kind of had fun, and Stephen would, you know, have some things written, and other uh, would take ideas to sort of improve upon it. So, so Paige, like when you first met Florence, like what was that like for her, <laughs> in addition to being for you? Well, I actually didn't meet Florence until after the movie was made. Oh. Right. So they were they were filming um, a lot of stuff in England too, and um, I couldn't go up there; I just had neck surgery. Like I wasn't allowed to fly at that point. So. Um, yeah, I got to meet her after the fact, like just before sun sundance. But she got my number, and she would text me all the time. And like, I mean, we we became pathetically like attached to each other. Like we loved each other a lot. And it was like a long lost pen pal, you know, when you finally get to meet each other. It's like I feel like I've known you forever, you know. So, um, but she did an incredible job. She's a talented actress. Like she, I mean, obviously she knows what she's doing. She made me look way better than what I actually am in real life. You should have seen me back then. I didn't have those eyebrows. <laughs> well. Aesthetically, way more pleasing. Uh, you know, the uh, I was, you know, so you just met her like right around Sunday. That was like, you know, two or three weeks ago. Damn, I was going to ask if like you wrestled, you know, like to see, like you know, if you. I'll take it now. <laughs> uh, you know, I just want I want to take questions from the audience. Like, what a great right chance here. to ask. It. Wait, wait, hang on. Before I do that, before I do that, I just got to mention. So this movie, you know, you all do Rotten Tomatoes and everything, right? So yeah. this movie's at 92% on Rotten Duh. Tomatoes. Duh! That's surprising. That's a better rating than First Man guy. Uh, <laughs> sorry, I love First Man, so I, you know. But uh, so, so Variety has called this movie uh, full of wit, heart, energy, and good charm. The Associated Press says it's lively, good-natured, warm-hearted, and fun. And, and this one particular world-famous, respected film critic uh, said it was charming, rousing, and an inspiring feel-good crowd-pleaser. Do you know what world-known, respected film critic said that? I did. <laughs> No. You did? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you just got like, first, like, like, Right there, yeah, yeah, go ahead. Well, first I have comments. First of all, Paige, you're one of my favorite female wrestlers of all time. Cheers, man. I love when you made your debut on SmackDown Live when you came back. Uh, thank you. You brought, oh, um, I think this. Absolution? Absolution. Oh. <laughs> that was on Raw. I debuted on SmackDown as general on, manager. Well, you're on Raw and SmackDown. Oh, I became the general manager. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm like the biggest fan.